Hey guys, how's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Welcome to another episode of The Body Beatdown with me, Michael, your incredible host. Well, here we go guys, this is part two of a three-part series uh, of my chest workout. Now, this was initially one long video, uh, so uh, it was my choice to go ahead and break it up into three sections because uh, it was kind of a long video and uh, I thought it would hold people's attention just a little bit better if it was broken up into three sections. So that's why some of the video might seem a little bit uh, edited and broken here and there, but it's pretty much uh, very understandable and uh, yeah. So uh, I hope that you get a little bit from this. Uh, in this exercise here, uh, we're going to be doing the Incline Smith Press. And um, my Smith machine is used and it was outside and the guide rods are kind of rusty in spots and all that. And it's not super smooth, so I can't go heavy and I don't go heavy anyways. And uh, so you're not going to see anything impressive as far as weights go, but you're going to see something impressive as far as someone working out and showing you maybe a couple of different little techniques that you might use while you're working out as far as uh, hand spacing and uh, full reps and quarter reps and three quarter reps and uh, using the top end of the movement versus the bottom end of the movement and the full range and all that kind of stuff. So you're gonna see some pretty cool stuff as far as that goes and uh, I hope it inspires you to try something new. And if it does, leave something in the comments, let me know what you got, okay? So let's get on with the Incline Smith Press. <sighs> All right, guys, our first set, I got the 45s on each side, and uh, we're gonna do pretty much full range of motion on this first set. So let's get it done. second set we're keeping the same 45s on each side and we're going to do uh, a bottom the bottom half of the rep which means we're going to come off the chest and just barely hit the extension just a little bit about the first quarter or so okay And you can also uh, vary your grip on the bar. Closer, about shoulder width, more wide. It just depends on what you're looking for. And it hits the pectoral muscles a little differently, but keep in mind it also hits the shoulder a little bit differently, okay? So be very mindful of that. Okay, we still got the 45s on each side. You see a trend here, right? You don't always have to go up too heavy, you know, to get a good workout. So on this set, we're gonna go and stick mostly with the upper half of the rep, which means we're gonna come down about halfway and then go back up, down about halfway and go back up, okay? Stick with me. And remember, you can vary your grips however you want. I'm gonna use a little bit more narrow grip on this one, just a little. Whew. 
All right, and this one here, we kept the 45s. No way. Yeah, we kept the 45s on. Now we're gonna do uh, more of a full range of motion and we're gonna go nice and slow. Okay, I'm gonna get about, about a shorter width uh, grip on it and we're just gonna push this set out nice and slow. All right guys, we're done with that first initial set of the Incline Smith uh, press. And you notice that we stuck with just 45s on each side, 145 on each side. Now I'm only gonna go up most likely to uh, putting a 35 on there as well. That's gonna come up to, one moment please. Many hours later. 160, and that's not including the weight of the bar and the whole carriage thing that you're pushing along with it uh i don't know about all smith machines but this one here i think uh really accentuate accentuates the weight uh more than it is it's an older smith machine the guide rods are rusted and and it was sitting outside when i got it so and it's been re-greased i re-greased it and everything but it's not super smooth it's okay but it definitely feels a lot heavier than what it is so uh, anyway, I'm gonna throw some 35s on there and uh, we're just gonna push out whatever reps we can do with this. So let's get that done. Uh, we wanna put a little bit of stress and strain uh, on the chest, okay? Let's do that. We're sticking with 160, a 45 and a 35 on each side. Again, that doesn't include the weight of the bar and this carriage here. Now what you're gonna notice I did maybe is you're gonna see I raised the safeties up to here, but I also put my pad on the bar uh, because these safeties, uh, they let me bottom out just a little bit too quick and that pad will give me just a smidgen bit of room so if anything goes wrong, at least I've got, uh, you know, I've got that cushion and uh, the stops there. So let's do that. All right, guys, that's it. That's part two, uh, the Smith Incline Press. I hope you got something useful out of it. If you did, don't forget, leave a comment. And while you're at it, like, share, subscribe, comment. All right, to the body beat down. And while you're also at it and you're looking at my beautiful face, go ahead and look at these beautiful shirts that I have. These are my babies. These, This is my design, the get up, get out, get ran, do it too. It's my saying, uh, the logo, the brand that I'm trying to push is 
D-I-T-I, -I, do it to it. And also the body beatdown logo. Look at that, my God, that's amazing. Yep, you need some of these shirts. They're positive, good, amazing shirts and they're gonna make you feel amazing about your day. So order you some of these up and spread the word and spread the message and be awesome, okay? So get ready for part number three where we're going to be doing incline dumbbell flies. And I'm gonna show you some kind of in-depth different things on that movement as well that you might not have ever seen or even thought of, guys. It's gonna be amazing. So be on the lookout for that video later. All right, don't forget guys, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beatdown. And we'll see you next time. Be an inspiration, inspire, and be amazing. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it. See y'all later. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it.